start our new lesson, I would like to ask you some questions that are related to our new lesson. Yes, when you want to talk about, when you want to express something that should or should not happen, but it happened. So what is the form that you use to talk? So I will give you some example. I should have listened to my teachers. So in this form, it means I didn't listen to my teacher. That's why I don't know what is the lesson talk about. So I feel very glad about it. That's why I say I should have listened to my teacher. I, yes, and another sentence is you should have gone out with your parents. In this sentence, it means you just stay home, you didn't go out with your parents. It means like maybe uh, the robber come to your house and steal something and then uh, it may drop, uh, they cause some trouble to you. So you feel, your parents will feel uh, some regret that you didn't go out with them. Yes. Okay everyone, so let's move to our new lesson. Our new lesson in all of us use this silent lesson two is talk about should have plus past participle or we can say that verb three right okay so should have plus past participle it means you use it to express about something that should or should not happen but didn't happen so I, in this lesson i have 21 vocabulary to explain all of you so let's go with me number one is escape it function as well it means to leave a place when someone try to catch you for example you did something wrong and then the police try to catch you and then you try to escape yourself from catching number two permission function as now being allowed to do something for example you want to stop for one day and then you ask a permission from your teacher that you want to stop for one day yes number three is about expensive function is attitude it means cheap or inexpensive expensive means you use your money to pay for something in a higher in a higher price for example i buy a very expensive clothes yes number four spill to accidentally flow of liquid over the egg of container for example I hold a cup of coffee and then accidentally someone uh, come to touch me and then I spill all the coffee from my, my cup. Yes. Number five, curious function as attitude, it means very angry. When you feel very angry with someone, you can say that I am curious. Don't say I am very curious because the word curious have worry inside it already. Yes. So you just say I am curious. Number six is unfortunately, function is at work is about unluckily. Unluckily, I buy a gift for you, but you ran out. It means you didn't get that gift, so you are unluckily to get a gift. Number seven, overhead, function as work means to hear by accident. When someone talks something bad about you, and then you just go and then you hear about them, it means you hear by accidentally. Number eight, it means horrible, function is attitude. It means horrible or very bad. You can say that. The weather is very terrible. Yes. Number nine, stomach ache. Stomach ache function is not in pain in your stomach, so you feel very hot, very pain in your stomach. So you can say, I am stomach ache. Number nine, worse. Function as attitude, it means very bad. Opposite with worse. Number eleven, it means appendicitis. Appendicitis. It means now an illness in which your appendage cause pain. Appendage, it means when you have appendicitis, you have to cut it. If you don't cut it, you will hurt in your stomach. Number 12, tongue. Function is now a container for holding a liquid. For example, swimming pool. You can say that it is a tank because it can keep a uh, uh, water that you can call liquid that you can swim inside it and also can keep a water. Number 13, upstairs. Upstairs function as at work. It means to work an upper floor in the building. For example, your friend asks, where, where, will, where will you go? You say, I go upstairs. I go to the upper floor of the, of the building. Number 14, it means ugly. Function as attitude, it means dirty. Yes. You are very dirty, you are very ugly. Yes. Number 15, 
Janitor. Janitor function as noun. It means a person who clean a school or a building. Or sometimes we can say cleaner. Yes, the simple word we call cleaner. Number 16, rust. Function as well, it means to move very quickly. The time that you leave school or the time that you leave your work, it we call rush hour because everyone moves very quickly to go to their house. 17. Land. Work to let someone borrow money or something from you. For example, when someone wants to borrow money from you and then you give your money to them, it means you lend your money to them. Number 18. Upset. Function as attitude, it means unhappy and worried about something. For example, your mom feel upset because she very worried about you when you go a, a very long distance, so she feel upset. And move to another vocabulary about loss. Function as well to become unable to find something. For example, I lose my marker and then I cannot find it, so I can say I lose my marker. Number 20, come out. Come out function is fresh or work because come is work plus with preposition. When work comes with preposition, it becomes fresh or work. So come out. Here means to become removed from something, or we can say that remove. Yes. Number 21, stand. Function as not a mark that is difficult to remove, or you can say that the stand is one come off. You it means the stand that uh, the coffee that uh, spill in your body and it is hard to remove. Yes. And about grammar point in this lesson, it is mainly talk about should have plus Work past participle we call verb three. In this form, we use to express something that should or should not have happened, but didn't happen. For example, I should have studied for the exam, but actually I didn't study anything for my exam. So I failed the exam, so I feel regret, and then I say, I should have studied for my exam. Number two, he shouldn't have told her anything. It means. When he told her everything, she felt angry and jealous with him. That's why he also feel regret that that thing shouldn't happen. Number three, I should have listened to my, my mother. That my mother very care about me. She asked me, don't go to that place but I go. So something bad happened. I may say, I should have listened to my mother. And about synonym and antonym. Synonym is the word that have the same meaning with each other. For example, Inexpensive, it means cheap. Inexpensive, opposite with expensive, so it means cheap. Terrible, very bad. Equal with horrible. Adapt, it means to take someone away. It means kidnap, yes. Antonym, it means the word that have opposite meaning with each other. Was, it means very bad. And was means very good. Number two, expensive, opposite with cheap. Upstairs, opposite with downstairs. Thank you so much. So now it's time to do the exercise. In this exercise, you have to listen and put number in order. So our speaker, we have six speaker. Number one, number two, number three, four, five, and six. And you have to listen and put all these speaker in order. So we have order from one until six. So you have to listen for two minutes. Okay, so let's start listening together. Two, page 86, exercise one. Listen and number in order. Joseph had a very bad day yesterday, though at the beginning of the evening, he was very excited. He was going to a party, and he was going to play with the band. And, of course, Lucy was going to be there. His night started well. He took a shower, and then he got dressed. He had bought a new pair of jeans, and a new t-shirt the day before. He thought he looked really good. He was ready to set off when he suddenly remembered he had left his electric guitar in his locker at school. He ran to the school as fast as he could. The janitor was fast asleep on his chair, so Joseph decided to go in without his permission. He ran to his locker, took his guitar out, and ran out. The janitor wasn't there anymore. He had gone home, and he had locked the school doors. Joseph was trapped inside the school. He yelled for help. He banged on the doors and windows, but nothing happened. He knew he had left his cell phone at home. 
and so he couldn't even call someone up for help. By 11, he knew he was in big trouble. He had missed the party, and his parents would be going crazy looking for him. Okay, so now it's time to pop in order uh, from number one to number six according to the sixth picture that uh, you have seen. So the first picture in order number one is picture number number six. And order number two is picture number five. Order number three is picture number four. Order number four is picture number three. Order number five is picture number two. And the last order is picture number one.